Hello everybody, I'm Kirsten Duke and welcome to Racing Passport. Group 1 action at Tear Up a Racecourse in New Zealand is coming up this Saturday and I cannot wait. One of the features being the BCD Group Sprint and on top is a Crochetti, an absolutely phenomenal animal at $2.30. Whitehawk's in the second line at $4.40 and Quintessa at $7. An interesting run of that one, but the one I want to focus on at the moment is Crochetti, an absolutely phenomenal animal and we're about to see why. On the rails, just behind the leader in those blue silks. Look at the way this horse extends. Absolute soul test further back in the field. Next, as they hit for home, was uh, Egyptian Queen, then Star of Justice, then came uh, Shoes and Feather Out December at the 250. Merchant Queen, the leader, Crochetti, has her in his sights. Two lengths away, then as they head down, looking to run on this Egyptian Queen, Crochetti made the lead at the 150, shooting for seventh. He is in seventh heaven, Crochetti. Brilliant fresh up, second over Merchant Queen. What a run from Egyptian Queen. I think brilliant is an absolute understatement. This uh, horse has just been absolutely phenomenal. Is currently unbeaten seven from seven and has every right to make it eight from eight. $2.30 I actually think is pretty good value for this runner of this level and consistency. Now, speaking of consistency, I think the only chance of an upset goes in the form of Quintessa. Now, you can see this runner just next to its stable mate midfield. It's the one with the blinkers. Look at the way it battles to the line. Sutherland, classic gallop to the 300. Impendabel over on the outside. Goes up to Leroy Brown. Quintessa's coming now. Zeb Mansour trying to wind up and Mary Shan is getting a run one off the fence. Quintessa and Penderbell, Mary Shan, Zed Mansour trying to wind up wider out as Cinnamon. A great finish, Quintessa. Zed Mansour's going to lunge, missed. Favourite will win, Quintessa, Zed Mansour, maybe in Penderbell. I just love the way this mare pushes on home. Absolutely fantastic effort there at Group Company. So we know she's up to the class. Form-wise, absolutely flawless. She's had four wins, two placings from six starts. And... I think if there's anyone who's going to rock the boat, this is the mare to do it. Would it really be a surprise if we saw the Tia Cal colours in the winner's circle again? I don't think so. That's why I'm more than happy to have Quintessa as my next best bet. I do think, though, Crochetti is absolutely going to be the one to beat. And the market very much reflects this. Now, punters, best of luck at the weekend. You can catch all the Group 1 action from Tear Rapper on Sky Racing. I'm Kirsten Duke. This was Racing Passport.